way to revolutionise electronics. We have the capability to make screens, ultimately, that are flexible, that are roll-up. Putting electronic capability into things like bottles and newspapers. Plastic electronics uses polymers which can be processed in solution form, so they can actually be processed as liquid and can be printed, they can be sprayed. Using new materials uh, based on carbon rather than silicon, it allows us to produce devices that are lightweight, that are easy to manufacture, that are low cost and potentially very rugged. We're looking at products which are biodegradable, biosoluble materials that when we print a circuit, it is used and it's thrown away. You can safely put it in your compost at home. These are conventional electric circuits, but they're printed using print technology on a flexible background. As you can see, they're very light, and if I drop these, they'll still work. We've created a flexible plastic display technology, which enables us to print plastic transistors onto a piece of plastic and create a display. Our displays are very, very light, they're very thin, they're very, very flexible, they're very robust, and they're very low power. Our primary uh, interest at the moment is on what we term smart packaging, where we are integrating electronic circuits into cardboard boxes, into paper. This may be as simple as having something like a business card, simple switch, uh, and a battery that we, we can put in there. Um, this, these batteries are all of the thickness of a human hair, um, but will actually functionalise a piece of paper. By using combinations of organic materials laid down in precise structures, we can create lights. And these lights can be made on either solid substrates, pieces of glass, or on plastic film. Imagine a room where instead of 12 lights in the ceiling, the entire ceiling is your light. The areas that we are interested in include medical, so you can imagine having a very small display in a device on your arm, which can read your blood pressure, which can read your um, heart rate. Um, automotive is also an interesting area. Imagine um, bending the display around a dashboard to have an integrated display. We're also interested in mobile devices, e-readers, mobile phones. Um, a more complex circuit like this will allow a patient to, um, to um, help them to take their medicine. So each one of these compartments would light up in a, in a particular sequence on a particular day. Uh, so it allows uh, maybe a more confused patient to, to safely take their products. This is an organic light emitting diode television. It's probably difficult for you to see, but the colors are fantastic. The contrast is amazing and the screen is very thin. But using the same techniques that are used to make this green OLED, and using solution processing and printing, we can make these devices ultimately on flexible substrates so that if you do drop it, it will still work. Imagine the roll-up TV.